Today, banana, you know. banana <laughs> breadfruit and yam, banana breadfruit and yam. yam. Wow, all right, plant. Now, a lot of people don't know, including myself, when I came to Jamaica, I didn't know you could eat green banana like this. Yeah. I really had no idea, though. I only know the sweet banana. And what type of banana is this one again? The name, Lakatan, Lakatan. so the Lakatan. Can I, Lakatan, oh, Lakatan. so it's very hard, actually, like a hard potato. Yeah, but it's hard. When Once it, it cooks, yeah, of course. Fucking sharp, really sharp. But it totally reminds me of a potato the first time Ooh. that I had it, and I had no idea you. And could I put the all the skin, in, me put the skin in there. Ah. I don't be able to think. I think and a banana kill me a boil, you know. And a <laughs> banana kill me a boil. Me boil the banana, they no um, they, they, they no change. Mm -hmm. Then brown and the water white. So no, it's some coloring. Me I go put on top of it like some ripe plant, you know. Yeah. Now, is this the best boiling kind, or is there other good times? Yeah, types man. Of banana best you can boiling boil? time, this. So, Lakatan is the number one. Yeah, like, man. Like other ones, like Valerie Gromish. I've never heard of anyone doing Gromish. What are them, man? What are them? Ah. But you just boil them and then stop. So, so, as long as they're green. Ah. Yes, sir. So, when you come to the yard here and you stay, there's so many bananas growing. Bananas are included when you stay here. So many different types. You can have like six, eight types of bananas. Today, we picked five different types of bananas. We had Lakatan, Gros Michel, Valerie. What else do we have today? I can't even remember. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, honey banana. Honey banana, the little one. Yeah. Yeah. So we don't charge, me don't charge. Me don't charge for banana at my place. This plantain here, is this a specific type of plantain for boiling? Ripe plant, man. Oh, ripe. So we get some sweet and some savory with the green banana. Yeah. Oh, cool. And some color, little greens. Wow. Okay, this is definitely a new one for me. I've had like... When you get breakfast, breakfast in Jamaica, they call it boiled food. So you get a dumpling, like flour dumpling, some boiled green banana often. What else do you get in boiled food? What? Yellow yam. Oh, yellow yam. Yellow yam. Okay. That's a classic Jamaican breakfast, and uh, but yeah, this is a this is dinner for us. This is a different world right now. Dinner, baby, <laughs> full boat. And now it's interesting. You're leaving the skins on the plantain. Yeah, but I leave on our robot. Really? Yes, sir. Huh. So you do it so. When I plow to about, they have to cook. They have no choice. <laughs> More than to cook, brother. Right now. Mm -hmm. Well, we'll see what mm -hmm. happens with the skins after. Interesting. Mm. Just Some pull. people put peeled banana and put the kidney in there. It's not good. What does it help do when you have the skin on it? Banana high on you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, banana high on man. Banana high on you high on man. So if you want to be a superhero like Iron Man? Mm. Eat some, eat some banana. Eat some fucking banana. Eat some banana. Fire red and then eat him. For one more. A bit steamy. Uh huh. Yeah, that kind of fits. It's kind of sort of. So, what do you do with the, the skins when it's fully cooked? You pull them out, or you leave them on the plate and people take them out themselves? Wow. The skins. No, I'm going to take them out and put them out and my people and play good, man. I'm going to take out the skin and put them and put the plant in and I... Just at the end. Look at them color, look at them. Huge Kalaloo plant. Yes, sir. And as you can see, most pieces, no worm business, no holes. No, no worm business, no, no worm business, you know. It's looking good. I take care of my Kalaloo because I want to give me guests, damn it, to eat. 
I'm a full food business, 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 I be doing them. I put up. I put up. No fuck you. No and talking about people. You know, no banga people. Beat blood. Business. Fucking business. You can't do like me. I'm a top chef. You know. Top chef number one. Man. Oh. Wow. That's what I've been saying for a long time. Yeah, no better look out than what you do. God bless no man curse. No fear. I'm gonna take care of no shit. I take care of myself. You know. I eat vegetable. You know. Nothing from the pork shop, you know. No. Nothing from the pig shop, you know. Pig shop, you hear that? <laughs> See that? Big yeah. up Tony Rebel. Yes, yeah, uh, fresh vegetable. <laughs> <laughs> wow, a lot of good looking cavalry. My man, people call me, tell me, you know, man. Tell me, say. Well, I'm coming out, I come at me that town, you know, I don't get no color to eat like that, like the one where you look about up there, you know. So. No, I've never seen it in such good condition. It's always I've just... I've colored all boat, brother. It's I always pick. spending an, half an hour picking it apart, trying to pick the good spots. Mm -hmm. So we don't go to the market, go buy the fertilizer one, we got the good one now. Yeah, yeah. We got the good one in our yard. I don't know if it's fertile or no color, though. We don't have to fertilize our color. Look on this one big color tree. The rats are going in the yard. Can't feel the, feel the whole nation. <laughs> Thick stem. Is this one that keeps on bearing? Like you just can pick it and it'll sort of come back again and again? Mm hmm. Ben, you cut it, you know, brother. Because uh, yeah, I can see a bunch of spots where you've trimmed it off before. Mm -hmm. right, yeah, yeah. As I said, I bird it, I bird it up so. I have something on it, brother. Boil soup. Here's the seeds, flowers. Yeah. It's flowering all over. Yeah, man. Is it like the sweet potato? If you leave it, you're just going to have callaloo all over the yard? So now I see more of them places. I breed no blow them out now. Mm -hmm. All up at them places, actually. Everywhere in the yard, pull up your color though. Yeah, it's pretty funny with the sweet potato the Ratti planted, it just exploded. Mm -hmm. So there's some sweet potato that Ratti planted. A little patch and it's just become a giant patch. This is all sweet potato from Ratti. A nice heart-shaped leaf, spade. <laughs> that's a lot. Mm -hmm. I'm guessing that's not all for the pot tonight. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm trying I'm to cook it sweet, man. Mm -hmm. Oh no. Try to cut up small amount this, but a good amount because you throw them a little bit. And a man here, if I'm a man here, you see them big. I'm a man here. Look. Everywhere you see color though. <laughs> Growing, springing. Yeah. New sprouts just come right by. Huh. I've seen you spend like, I swear, an hour on some uh, really no. holy looking calorie. I'm not your dog around. I'm a dog, I say dog want water, dog want TV and everything, and I'm blood clotted. You can't believe this. See how there's some good people coming here, they plant me good on the gotcha pangy, they're in the day, so I see. Why find the color of the tree today, you know? And I look at people that feed, people come to me and say they don't get the good color of the tree. I didn't know it was a, like a tree like that or a bush. We get the spinach and stuff. I thought it was more like that or lettuce. It's a small kind of thing. I have these lettuces in my yard that grow really tall, but they're not that good. But they certainly don't have a, a trunk like like the Kalaloo here. You yeah, gotta pick them when they're young though or else they're no good. They get, oh, they get too old, old, they get toughy, toughy and bitter and oh. they're just not that good, so. Lettuce, lettuce. That's the one where you eat pound food, that's the one they attack. Yeah. Oh, 
know, you see Amarant, be Amarant there, there. You know them. Mm -hmm. I remember and try something. Yeah, they're good. I like them because you can eat this. You can eat the uh, the stem on them easy because it's pretty soft. But, mm, but, but the ones that I grow, you you just have the leaves, much like color. I remember by a pack. Because yeah. these ones, you don't eat the stem, right? It's pure. Yeah, pure man, leaf. Eat everything, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, man. Well, not right now. You're trimming it all off. Yeah, man. Look where I go on. I'm a car research. Car and can do research when I see something. <laughs> no, man, I eat it. I'm sick. I'm gonna eat that bug. <laughs> no buggies allowed. Mm -mm. Like we learned with our cornmeal porridge one day. No, I think what kind of bug is it? A <laughs> fireman bug fell in or something? Yeah, we got cool bug one. Oh, hi. It's Matthew here. Just wanted to thank the sponsor for this video, and that is Magic Spoon. I am beyond stoked to have them as a sponsor. I pretty much haven't eaten cereal in 20 years. When I realized it really wasn't good for you, there's so much sugar, so much junk, so much carbs. And even though I love cereals from a certain toucan who enjoyed loopy, fruity things, and another certain leprechaun who I won't name, I just pretty much gave it up. And that was until I heard about Magic Spoon on the Tim Ferriss Show. There's zero grams of sugar, 14 grams of protein, only four net carbs in each serving, and it's also 140 calories. You can try Magic Spoon's best-selling flavors in a four flavor variety pack with cocoa, frosted, peanut butter, and fruity. I'm a huge fan of the cocoa, 100%. Magic Spoon also offers other great flavors like blueberry, cookies and cream, maple waffle, and cinnamon. Although it's healthy, it tastes exactly like these cereals from your childhood. It's almost unbelievable. It's keto-friendly, gluten-free, soy-free, grain-free, and low-carb. Now, Magic Spoon is so confident in their product, they're offering a 100% money-back guarantee. No questions asked. If for any reason you're not happy 100% with the cereal, they will refund you all the way. And for my Canadian and British fans, Magic Spoon is now shipping to Canada and the UK, so worldwide cereal goodness. Click the link below for $5 off, just use the code Ross Kitchen, or go to Magic Spoon slash Ross Kitchen and save your $5 today. It's actually been really hard to, to make this, I'll just keep eating the cereal and getting sidetracked and disappearing into space, but yeah, anyway. Real big right now. Yes, sir. But stay tuned. This is not hot, bro. Not yet, not yet. <laughs> Me? No way. Yeah, Can you? Yeah, I'm burned, bro. Here's my tough man challenge right now, which I will not try in five minutes. Why is that burning? Why is that step burning? The man is here. <laughs> Someone's getting gains in the background. Those are like half pull-ups, bro. Still pretty good though. Pretty impressive compared Twelve. to the average human, I'd say. Twelve, Matthew. Twelve. Good on you, mate. I bet Darius could. If he wanted to. Darius can beat a hundred. Dude, 100 pull-ups? Come on, 10 is hard. No, I do 12, bro. 100 is different than 12, bro. Then 100 is the same thing. Can you just take out there's one of the zero of 100? It's 10. Oh, I get it. See? You don't see that, Matthew? I jump from all the way up to up here. Future what track I star? I stay right here. I jump all the way up in there. Think I can do it? Yo. Yo! Did you see me flying the drone around here? No. Oh. I see nothing. Oh, no. Oh, oh. Copy me, see ya! You can't see me that he hopes he do that. Up to you, why? You can't do it on top of the roof. Who listens to me? I'll tell you. You're going to have more than both of them. You're going to have more than both of them. See that, Darius? 
push out my, my unstun. That's pretty impressive. Think you can do? Think you can do that? Mm. I don't do two of them. Steaming, but still work to go. Yeah. Kind of slow. Yeah, not sure, but me then, uh, steer it up, man. We go put the camera wide down, John High, let know, Matthew. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right, now dry out the rice. Yeah. Get some more juice. Don't do something. Hey, buggy. Move, man, move. Calm down, man. talking about this rush. That's the part of color low. See there not knowing there when it swing? Yeah, no kidding. It's already about half the size. Mm. Yeah. The one cut again. Is that all the color cut up? <laughs> yes yeah, man. Holy Jesus. <laughs> nah, I'm just color it's like five times bigger. Yeah man. Wow. wow. Impressive. Not till the same time it's steam, not in there, brother. You know what I go get down there, right? You know, make it look good. Oil. Give it some shit. I mean, not, me, yeah, I mean, not steam color, though. At least I go try one day, you know, I go try something. You know. Because this, you know, you get some, chop it up and make like, mix it up and make flitters. Oh yeah, yeah. Color kind of of flitters. Cool. New blood clad one. Yeah, I never had that one before. You don't know. I mean, this will do me something. <laughs> Just make it up. Just make it up and make yeah. it and see if it will work and that will work. Yeah, we can't go wrong. Fritters are good. Color is good. Come yeah, on, color look flitters. One day. Okay. Yeah. I'm adding that to the list. It's coming. That oil really makes a difference. Nah, tell you what, so make me put me something in there. We do want the water it out for that and the oil. So it must cook good and sharp, you know. This is coffee, done. Happy guy. Is that the new routine? Ah, like, as long as it's, it's not a carrot. I don't know what you with that. It's a carrot. You seen any of those big black Goliath beetles lately that we saw the other time? Mm -hmm. Remember the huge black ones with the horns on them? When it was raining last time. That was cool. So when you guys were living up in the bush, you used to grow a lot of this, didn't you? Mm, I eat them. Man. Mm. All the time. I have all type of papaya. I you know. have the African one up there. I have the red one, the blood shedding one. Yeah. I have the green one and the African one up there too. No one of them. I grow them both there. I yeah. The red one didn't take longer. Huh. I don't think I've seen the red one yet. Mm, red one. No. Is it really red looking or just a little different color? Than like that? this, man. Like this. So when I cook, when I steam them, the whole water turn red like this. Ah. You don't have a green water like this. Like a red pea look. Huh? Yeah. It's a yellow heart, but too. Is it yellow? Yeah. Yellow heart, that. And actually, I turn it, but one in eating. Nice. Maybe with cabbage. Now comes the work part though. You gotta pull off all the plants and <laughs> the plating you always take care with. Yes, sir. This looks wild. Whoa! Big plate tonight. Well, I'm going for the calorie first. Mmm! So perfectly cooked. 
Good. Even the stem, sometimes people make it and it's really too hard still. Mm. Mm. And to try and get the better food. Hmm. I'm not getting good amount of meat today. Can't do them that. <laughs> the color on the green banana is interesting because it, it turns completely brown. Mm-hmm. No, no, brother. Color no water. Put water for it and then after I get the color of those tender and soft like that. And the breadfruit you can see is totally soft. Mm -hmm. I can put the fork in and it comes right back out. That's a properly, properly done. Properly cooked bread. Mmm. Mm. Man. Because the breadfruit and the green banana, they're kind of bland on their own, right? Mm -hmm. But the second you get something like a nice saucy, oily but, 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 but. Ooh. Yeah, we cut out the breadfruit, but it's not the top. Ah, okay. Get the heart out of it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If you boil the fruit, then top it up, you know. Yeah. Then on time. Okay. And then this is the, uh, the yeah, plantain man. sweet one. Yeah, man. Oh, I didn't even know there was a yam in the mix. Yeah, man. Huh. Well, yeah, man. Yeah, 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 man. Killer, man. Yeah, man. Ooh. The banana is getting soft. Mm. You know, got no teeth, you know, so I have to make myself sad. <laughs> I got you. No dental, so I have to make myself you know? <laughs> hey, it works even if you got teeth or without, so. Mm. I'm putting one dental, you know. Dude, the kalaloo is so good. <laughs> it's so savory. Mmm. I like it, man. I food, man. You call your bread food. But they put it in China, we stick with China. You know, China, China like rice, you know. Hey, hey, hey. People come here for vital food. For special health, you know? Mm-hmm. But, but then we know. But then come and say they want vital food. I have to know it's expensive. Man, all the rest of food. Not even chicken, not even nothing. They especially cost my food. I have a bit already, you know. But the pressure is people come at people's place, so they want to talk at that business place. And go onto them and eat all food. Make certain no. If they know. If the people know about it, they have to pay more. Hmm. You have to pay more, yeah? You pay a bit more, but I. 100% worth it. Good job.